Hi everyone, welcome to our channel Agilasem Schools and this video will be covering exercise 15.3 of chapter Visualizing Solid Shapes from NCRT textbook of grade 7 mathematics. So let's see what we have in this exercise. We have a question number one says, what cross sections do you get when you give a vertical cut and a horizontal cut to the following solids? First of all, a brick. So if I give a vertical cut to a brick, it will come something like this. So you get two bricks of bit little half the width rather I'll say and if it is a vertical cut so you will get maybe two cubes if it is equal else it will be a small brick. So both we have shown which is represented in this manner. Now giving cut to a round apple so first one will be I'll get if it, I, I'm giving a horizontal cut it will be two cuts this way and if you give a vertical cut it will be this way. To a dice if you give a cut it will be like this the vertical cut and horizontal cut will be this way and lastly to a circular pipe so circular pipe will obviously get of reduced length if it is a horizontal cut and if it is a vertical cut you will get two halves of a pipe. To ice cream cone so obviously the cone will be cut into two pieces if it's horizontal cut and if it's a vertical cut you will get a smaller cone and a hollow cone type structure with two slants and two small spheres with a horizontal cut. So this has been done for you. You can see this. This is vertical cut in the part A and second reflects horizontal cut. So this is all from this exercise. Thanks for watching this video. For more such informative videos, please do subscribe to our channel and keep browsing Aglasen schools. Thank you.